Hey everyone, it's TK421 Tom Kane. I was lucky enough to persuade this guy. He's popping. He is busy. He is a, he's like one of my busiest friends. Yeah. Uh, which is fine. I don't get uh, I don't get upset about that. And 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 you can't really. It's not like we don't talk to each other every other day and I'm asking for advice or yeah. uh, talking on YouTube and stuff like that. Texting. Texting. Uh, but this week I got to hang out with him twice. Two times in one week, which is amazing. Uh, again, uh, I'm getting busier. A lot of change in my life. Good. Change is positive. It's yeah. never, I don't think it's ever a negative thing. Sometimes it seems. Depends on how you embrace it. Yeah. You know? Sometimes change can seem a little negative at first, but it's the outcome of that change that could either be negative or positive. A friend of mine just got divorced and, and he, now the change is good because he met somebody that was way more better. There you go. Way, way more, more better. better. Better? Betterer. Just, like, just better? It's, it's just better -er. yeah, And now better is the better way to say that. <laughs> uh, I speak them good English. Uh, so now he's happy. So like That's Burke good. said, the embracing of that change yeah. and the result of that change is where... It's all about how you embrace it. Embracing change. Embrace the change. I think today I'm going to call this embracing the change. Embracing the change. We were just walking down the trail and Burke says, why don't we do this more often? And that's kind of a good question. Why don't we? Is it, is it time? Is it energy? Is it bad planning? I think it's a combination of time and, and poor planning because it seems like the few times that I was like, oh, hey, I'm available, you were away. But it's not like we ever like say like, hey, in like a week or so, are you free this day? Do you want to go and shoot? I feel like a majority of the time it's like, hey, are you free today? And hmm. most of the time it's not. And making the time is a better policy. Mm -hmm. You want to hang out, go shoot somewhere, and we can make a plan to go somewhere. And actually, like, that way, each of us has the time to, that bridge looks so cool. Each of us has the time to find it out. Look at that. Yeah. So I just got done hanging out with uh, Burke Cullinane, a uh, great friend. He spent the day at the Quabbin doing some videoing, picture, chatting, uh, and he said something that was hard for me to accept. He said, Tom, you're a creator, you are a YouTuber. And I've only put five videos up on YouTube, so I kind of thought in my head, me putting up five videos on YouTube is like me eating a veggie burger and saying I'm a vegetarian. I, you know, I am trying, uh, I think that one of the big things was Premiere Pro was very elusive for me. I just don't have the mind for it. It's uh, it's sort of like the metric system. You know, I dabbled in it, I tried really hard, and it actually ended up holding me back from being creative. I've been using LumaVision, uh, and it's worked out really well. I really enjoy it. I'm a cell phone, Instagram type of person, so it just really worked for my physicality or my psyche or whatever you want to call it. I don't even know what it's called. Um, but it was awesome and I'm creating. And little by little I am feeling like a creator. Uh, I don't know if I'm there yet. It's just, it's hard for me. I don't look at myself in the mirror for that. I'm a late starter. I got into this at age 51-ish by accident. So it was a great day. I enjoyed it. It was nice just to get out in nature and uh, yeah, it was just a nice time to be out in nature and enjoy the scenery and good friendship. Good friendship with a good guy. Uh, check him out at his channel too. And I'll link it somewhere 